Hello and welcome to this video. In this video, we're going to discuss how you can get the best seller badge from Amazon. Before we get started with this video, please consider subscribing. Just click the red subscribe button and, and the bell button so you can get notified when I bring out a new video. It really helps my channel and I'm sure you'll love my videos. But let's get right into it. So you may be asking, we may be thinking, what is the best seller badge? Well, if you've ever shopped on Amazon, you may notice that some of the products have like an orange best seller on top of them. And that means that they are the best seller in either their category or their subcategory, but they are selling the most and they are doing the best. And why is that a good thing? Well, not only is it a good thing because they're doing the best, but it's also a great thing because it's a lot of social proof. And a lot of people will see a product that has a best seller and they'll be like, oh, they're best seller, they, they must be good. Everyone else is buying from them. And they'll go to your page and then they'll see your page and they'll buy your item. And because you had that best seller badge, you're able to get that many more um, eyes on your page because people love the social proof. And using this method, we were able to get a bestseller badge within four days. So I want to make a quick YouTube video, literally nothing too long, like two minutes in now. I don't want it to be longer than four minutes. Just um, telling the process because this isn't a confusing process. So what you'll have to do is, you have to do, um, you would have to change your category. So depending, I don't know what category you're in now, um, but have a look at what category you're in now and look at what, or subcategory I should say, look at your subcategory and then find a subcategory that's similar, but completely not, uh, much less competitive. So you would find, a, um, what you would find is that there should be a subcategory that is a lot less competitive than your current subcategory. So once you list yourself in that category, the next thing you have to do is you're gonna do a four day giveaway or a four day price drop, whichever one you prefer. A four day giveaway means day one, you give away five items, day two, you give away 10, day three, you give away 15, and day four, you give away 20. And what that does is it shows Amazon they're getting consistent sales more and more and more and more and more. And eventually, not only will it shoot you up in the rank, but getting those 20 sales in this smaller subcategory that not many people are competing in will get you your best seller badge. And it doesn't matter if you've got the best seller badge in one category, but someone searches for you on the listing in something else, you'll always be shown on your page, as long as you have the best seller badge, it will always show above your image that you have the best seller badge. And if you don't wanna do giveaways, you can also do this via the price drop method, which is you drop your price down to break even four days. It might take longer because you're not doing a giveaway, so it could be 10 days, and um, you increase your sales. So for example, we did the giveaway method. It was much quicker, but just to see how the price drop method worked, we also did that, and we did the price drop method to break even, and we got 70 sales, 111 sales. We got a, a ton of sales. Literally, we got over 100 sales on some of the days. We got 50 sales on some of the days, and it shut us all the way up. So our bestseller badge is stuck there. We have that for a while now. So that is how you can get a bestseller badge. Literally all it takes is changing your subcategory to something less popular, doing a giveaway for a week or doing a price drop for a week. It's that easy. And as soon as you get it, you're gonna get so many more sales. So let me know what you think in the comments. Let me know if you think this is a good strategy and if you're gonna implement it. And um, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe for more videos. Thank you so much and I'm. I think I'm, 14 days into this 100 day challenge and I'm really loving it and um, I really appreciate everyone who views the video so thank you very much and I'll look forward to seeing you in tomorrow's video.